Welp, I am back playing Pizza Tower, and in this episode, I'm going to be getting the rest of the clothes in Pizza Pursuit. There was something here for that yellow cape gremlin. Don't know if this one will work for you, big guy. Funny thing, I actually know which one that is referring to, but I'm saving that one to the end. So make sure you stick around for that. You, in that mini golf place, that final course can be skipped, you know, for only one lap, of course. But if you were able to skip that second lap, I heard you get something if you do that final course on the third lap. Lap two, skip on, to golf we go. All right, here we are, the final course. You. And it's as simple as that. Except it's not gonna be so simple on lap three. Okay, the strategy I went for didn't work, but, uh, we take those. And there we go. Blessing Bliss. Shut up. Another day. Alright, what do you have to say? I heard about an interesting detail regarding that one explosive timer you might encounter. Supposedly, it'll reward you if you manage to escape just barely before it goes off. Alright. Extended war timer on. Let's go to the Oregano Desert. Alright, lap four. I gotta figure out how to waste time somewhere. No. What the fuck? Ah! Oh my god. Ah! God damn it. 20. 2,000 years later. There we go! Kinetic Kaboom. Okay, I know you've probably heard about getting higher ranks and all that, but word had it that if you clear third go around a level with the worst rank you can get, it might be worth your while. Ah, oh boy. Back to golf we go. Yes! There we go. I was worried there for a second that it would not give it to me. But there it is. Phew. 78 damage. Nice. I heard about a lunatic switch that needs to be on, if so. I was told about this pizza face guy doesn't like it when you taunt him, but at the same time I heard that taunting enough and escaping is what you want to do. I'd say at least eight of them. All right, one, two, three.
All right, we're good. Five, four, five. Bruh. Are you fucking kidding me? The Fortnite third party. Five, six, seven. He's fast as fuck now. Eight. All right, there we go. Ludicrous logs. One of my intel people found out something about that warfield in the tower. Leaving on the third lap, that elusive perfect rank will net you something, but only if you skip that pe pesky second lap. Ah, <sighs> there we go. Fancyish fedora. One of my intels had a chuckle at this one, but they said they'd give you something if you just don't go into any other rooms. When that warlike timer appears on around the levels, you do. I think they like explosions or something. Try that on lap five for the guy. All right. There we go. Goofiest goober. It's just a bunch of cat pictures. I've heard those laps you do around those levels have special tunes associated. One of my intel people really likes that third lap tune from the Lunatic variants. Said they'd make it worth your while if you listen to the whole thing. Alright, here we are.
Still got it. Fearsome floof. I heard something about a trick-filled level full of pumpkins. They told me to go through there and check out every room, but they also said to avoid as many pumpkins as I could. This intel only applies on lap 5, I was told. So don't worry about those silly other laps. Alright. There we go. Dazzling diamond. Back for more. Got more intel for you. Here's what I got. That blue porcupine looking fellow seems to mess with you a lot, huh? Well, one of my intel people said that guy appreciates a lack of contact. Don't hurt or get hurt by him is what I guess. It, at least for a laugh. And he hit me. I didn't get it. There we go. Sly Snooper. I think that leaves one last clothing item. Well, one more and then another one I'm saving for a later date. Before we swap to noise, we might as well see this one. Jake, Jake. Jake! This one's specific for you. It seems that tutorial of yours. I was told if you got through five whole rounds of the tutorial fast enough, you'll probably find something. And there we have it. Monochrome Madness. You might have just gotten all those exclusive clothes you could. Pretty sweet. Don't worry though, I ain't going anywhere. I'll, I'll still be here cheering you on. And that was every clothing item in Pizza Pursuit. Except for one that's going to be down the road. But with that being said, I'm going to leave it here for this episode of Pizza Tower. If you enjoyed what you saw, make sure to like and subscribe. You know what to do. And I'll see ya.